All right, I finally got through this. I had to erase the pencil at the end. All right, let's talk to ya Mr. Yanny Yanny Man. The truth of space and time moves through the universe like a wave. Truth speaks through space and matter and makes itself known to human beings. I was waiting for you, and you came. This was destined to happen. In truth, all is predetermined. Ness, Paula, Jeff, and Pooh. When these four powers gather, Twisted Space will bring back peace to the world. Do you understand? It doesn't matter. Proceed as you wish. Open the treasure box and take what is inside with you. Did you come in search of this? Someone left behind this in this hole. Alright, I got my thing. I got the ogre dispenser. So skill the wizards. We learned the skill from the monkey over there. Would you like to learn this special power? Yes. It's wonderful. Speak to the monkey over there. Alright, do I have to give him something too? I'll teach you teleportation. Let's go outside. First, let's see what's in here. There's a brain food lunch. I don't want it. And in here is a cup of life noodles, which I could use, but I have no room now. Oh, uh, whatever. Let's go talk to the monkey outside. I have a chicken on me, and ho I had a chicken on me ho in hopes of getting a fresh egg for one of the monkeys, but forget it. I've already got what I need now. Let's go learn this teleportation thing. How does it work, even? Do I teleport to a specific town, or, like, what? It'll probably come in handy. I won't have to pay for the bus anymore. Maybe I can also go to my home, and instead of paying a Escargo Express all the time... Sure, it's taking a while to uh, get out of here, though, I'll tell you that. There we are. Okay, now, monkey, teach me teleportation. Are you the monkey? Hikiki, follow me, like this way. Alright, I'm following you. I'm following you. I hope I don't get sunstroke. Okay, I'll do a teacher's demonstration. If you can learn this, you can go anywhere you've been previously. You can go there instantly. This skill can't be used... In a room or dungeon, though. And now... What do you just do? I went to Foresight and returned. I showed you the basic straight course. But you can also build enough speed while turning if you have enough room. Okay, why don't you try it, young man? How does one use it? Let's learn how to use PSI teleportation. Great! Okay, the teacher is going home now. Great. So, PSI teleport uses two. Let's go to on it quickly for the fun of it. Well, I can easily recover PP. Alright, oh, I haven't been on it in a while. Let's go visit home and, uh... Can I give her stuff directly? Without having to, uh... Keep calling for, uh... What's its face? The Escargo Express? Or do I have to always call them? Ah, Snake's afraid. Alright then. Let's see if I can talk to my sister. Doesn't want to go outside, apparently. You're back! Don't bother yourself with talking now. You look too tired. Why don't I understand these things? Eat some steak and screw up to bed. I like how she gives me steak. Oh, right. I haven't been here in a while. At least now I don't have to worry about bus travel. Actually, a bus doesn't even take me here. Let's go talk to my sister. See if I can give her stuff. Oh, it's my line now? Oops. Yes. What do you want me to do? Store. Oh, I can store stuff. Good. Uh, what do I want to store? Hand aid. Yes. What else should I give her? Well, uh, pencil eraser, because I don't think I need that right now. Of course, for all I know, I might. Alright then. Broken tube. Uh, I guess I'll give the chicken back. Yeah, I'll give the chicken back. And one more thing I'll give is the uh, laser gun. I think that's all I need to give. I think that's all I need to give. I'm good. Cool. At least now I can come here more easily. Better than doing what I've been doing for the past while. Alright, so let's go back to Foresight with my weird trout yogurt machine. Uh, so, teleport to 
Oh, I can even go to Winters now. Cool. Uh, Foresight. I'll go to Winters after. All right. Okay. All right. We need a... Man, we need a good distance to do that, unfortunately. Let's just recover that PP I wasted. All right. Okay. I thought I could do it on turns. They lied to me. They lied to me. Man, do I even have a good place with distance here? Let's see... Any good... Maybe this street would be good if I go all the way down here. This might be good. Unless I can run into, like, people, too. Okay, let's try this again. Teleport. To four side. Alright, there we go. Back at four side. Now that I've got that machine, where am I supposed to meet the maid? Because she wants it. Well, somebody wants it. The maid wants to give it to what? Pokey or something? Now, the maid... I met her at the cafe randomly. I don't know if I had ever seen her before. Oh, there she is. I kept asking her for a joke. Okay, here we go. Uh, who has it? Who has it? I should still have it, right? Where is it? Where is it? I... Where is it? You gotta be kidding me, I don't have it? Didn't I get it? Wait, I'm confused here. I didn't get it? I don't remember storing it away. Uh, what? Wait, what? Okay, wait, give me a second here. Give me a second here. I need to go back. Okay, I accidentally accidentally stored it away instead of the chicken. That's where my uh thing kept uh getting ruined. Okay, you're so okay. I'll make some for you. My room's on the forty eighth floor. Don't forget to drop by. Forty eighth floor. Can I take that elevator now? Because I can only go up to the 47th floor. Okay, yeah, I accidentally stored away the yogurt machine. I don't know why. I meant to store away the chicken. I must have incorrectly, uh... selected it. Well, that sucks. Alright, this time... This time, I'm gonna meet the maid, who I gave the yogurt dispenser to. So, can I go here now? Alright, I can go here now. Chinest, Mr. Molotov's made a lecture told me about you. I'll take you to Mr. Molotov's office on the 48th floor. Only you may go. Only Ness may go? Or can Jeff go? Be more specific here. Whatever. Alright then. Ooh, creepy music. Am I gonna do no Robot! Secret code, please. Say your code in 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. There was no way I could do a code. I got a sentry robot. Oh, he fired a rocket at Jeff. Why did the maid invite me here if they're just gonna beat on me anyways? He called for help? What an I ass. Uh, PSI. Cover life up on Jeff. Oh, no, you don't. Life up. Stupid robot. Good, he didn't get the call for help this time. Fired a beam at Jeff. Ah, right, why'd you miss? Great, now I'm battling these stupid robots. Don't with the. At least he didn't do the rocket. The rocket hurts most. Okay, so... Is that the thing with the machine gun they were talking about? I don't really know. It's in here. Uh... Um... Bathroom? Grown. I can't say a code. I have to battle them! Alright then, there's a lot of doors here. Another robot, apparently. 
Um, okay, I just went into the same room. It's like a classroom. Um, there's a lot of doors here, though. I will say that. Don't tell me you got me in the back. What's my code? I don't think I have a code. Okay, two more doors here, and they lead... Uh, hello. Hi. Your trout fairy yogurt, sir. Let's got the trout yogurt. Master Pokey's cool. He gave you something the day, other day and said, This is fit for a maid. Huh, huh. What am I supposed to do with that yogurt? Am I supposed to give it to, uh... Pokey? Or... Am I looking for Monotoli? What the... Ping, clankety clanky. Rattle rattle drawer. Squeak squeak clank. Ah, it's like a boss? Clumsy robot. Okay, then it looks like a boss, so I'm gonna use my big ball rocket. Did not work. What the? Uh-huh. How about rocking? Let's just try this first. Oh, what the hell was that? Ah. Uh. Okay, um recover on Ness goods. Oh come on, please. What the hell? I can't attack this guy or something? I got very little to use on him even. I don't really know. Okay. Uh PSI. Recover life up on Jeff. Oh, no, I didn't do it in time. Oh, man, what am I supposed to do here? My bottle rockets don't work on him. He, 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 he didn't, don't tell me he just maxed out his HP. Oh, man. He has a lot of wasted moves, I will say that. I'm missing a lot, too. He's a clumsy robot. He wanted to go get a battery? He lost some gears and bolts. Suddenly, all of a sudden, some guy's rushing to the room. It was the Runaway Five! What the? Lucky quickly ducked behind the robot. I flipped the switch and it stopped. Ha ha ha, jeez, what a loser robot. It was so easy to stop. That was a quick thinking. Okay. I lost Jeff, you know, in the process because he kept shooting crap at me. Wow. That was a lot of uh, XP. The Runaway 5 suddenly came in. I lost Jeff, though. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, you know what? I'm going to meet you guys back here. I'm going to get Jeff back. Alright. Now that Jeff is back... Seems suspicious, huh? Alright, let's go in and see what's in here. Stop! That's enough! Please stop! I give up! I really do! I don't trust that bear back there. Ness! You finally made it here. I'm fine. I believe you'd come and save me. Mr. Monotoli isn't really a bad person. Take some time to listen to him. Alright, fine. Look at my skinny arms, thin body, and gray hair. I've become so weak since I lost the Manny Manny statue. I'm sorry I kidnapped Paula. I haven't done anything to her. Paula is a nice girl. Paula, return to Ness. I'm sorry I've created so much trouble for you. Alright, we got Paula back. I That wall over there is suspicious. I'm going to go look at it. Paula joins you once again. I'll tell you everything. The Manny Manny statue creates an illusion. It attracts evil spirits and weakens your heart. The power scared me so much I hid the statue in the warehouse at Jackie's Cafe. I often went there to pray. Cryptic words appeared to me while I was in the illusion. Ness, your name appeared in the cryptic message. Stop Ness and do by your own hand. Or, don't let them go to Summers. Or, make sure they know nothing of the pyramid. I don't fully understand the messages, but someone obviously doesn't want you to go to Summers. Evil Gigas or something, I could hear the name. Anyway, the evil side would be in trouble if you visit Summers. Oh, on the contrary, you should definitely go to Summers, especially because they don't want you to make it there. 
Would you like to hear the, the whole story again? No. Summons is located across the ocean. Take my helicopter. I'll open the door to my heliport. Aha, uh -huh, so that's what the bear does. He just blocked the exit out. Well, okay, so I have to check that out anyways. I guess I'll be going to Summers then. You must go on. Ness, this is your destiny. Paula, it's time we said goodbye. Take care. Alright, then I'll go to Summers. I was all prepared to fight a boss here. Turns out there's nothing. Just gotta take the helicopter to... Summers. I know Winters had some what appeared to be good stuff. Maybe I should head back there. There's also someone I could talk... Oh, actually... Eh... Uh, whoa. Looks like they're trying to crash into me or something. Ness, you pin-headed idiot! You're just a half a step too slow. I'm getting out of here. Since Montoya has become a plain old man again, I have no more use for him. This helicopter will really come in handy. Looks like you're the world-class loser again. A pokey just took it. That's no help. Uh, what do you have to say about that, Mr. Monotoli? How did Pokey even get up here? Pokey took the helicopter. I hope he's okay. Okay, so now how do I get the Summers? Huh? Yes, Paula? Ooh, I was a little dizzy, but now I'm okay. To get the Summers, we need to go back to Threed. Yep, somehow I know that's where we must go. Okay, then we'll go to Threed. Wow, you guys did a lot while I was in the bathroom. Ha ha ha! You want to go to Threed as soon as possible? We can take you to Threed in our tour bus. I'll get the bus and wait for you, you outside. Just outside the building. I'm reading crappy again. Hooray! I was reading too fast. I'm getting too excited, I think. I gotta take my heart medication. I'm kidding. I don't have a heart. No, yeah, whatever. Anyways, now we get the happy Runaway 5 music, and they're probably just going to end up at another place where they got to pay another bagillion dollars to some jerk-ass manager. All these doors to leave. Hello? Still groaning? Even the girls' bathroom is just groaning. A lot of walking I got to get out. Hello? He's calling me. Hello, how are you? This is Apple Kid. I think I'm a real genius. In fact, I know I'm a genius. Why? Well, I've discovered the primary enemy of you and all of humanity. We have to fight and defeat this being. To do so, we need to invent a machine called the Phase Distort Distorter. I've got to find the wandering scientist, Dr. N Donuts, and make this distorter, so I may be gone for a while. Later, click. Well, I know where he is. He's in Winters. That's Jeff's father. Would I think what? No, it's not too much. Oh. Um. Well, I know you wanted the Runaway 5's autograph. What happens if I had said yes? Regardless, um, let's go back to Threed. Hooray! It's still the Runaway 5 happy music. Except when I get into the elevator, that's all depressing. Oh, you wouldn't say that to the Runaway 5, would you? That's because they're famous musicians. I assume they're famous, I don't really know. They seem to get into a lot of problems. Ugh. Who is it now? Hello, this is Orange Kid. So I haven't called lately. I'm still working on the way to change boiled eggs into raw eggs. It's taking longer than I thought. I'm going to really work at it, though. Talk to me later if you click. Why would I want to change uh, boiled eggs into raw eggs? And that doesn't even make sense. Okay, you can get on the bus now. Why? So I'm basically reversing the process. Whatever. A lot of weird stuff going on in this game. Well. Just gonna go back to Threed. Apparently, Paula says that's where we need to go to get to Summers. How do we get there? Hmm. There's probably a new guy waiting for us. I can always teleport myself to Winters. Because I've been there before. Yeah, it's a pretty long journey, but this is, might be going a bit faster than the typical bus, so that's good. At least it might go a bit faster to get back to Threed. Still a long trip, regardless. 
Because we still got at least another tunnel after this. One more tunnel, and then I don't know where it's going to drop me by to begin with. At the beginning of the town, or in the middle of it? Maybe the circus will bring me to uh, Summers. Maybe they're going to be traveling uh, to Summers to perform now. Oh yeah, if you want pizza, you have to call for it on your phone. You can't just order pizza. That's sucky. Alright, we made it. I'm sorry we couldn't do more for you. Remember, though, we're on your side. When you're having a tough time, just think of our songs. Imagine a runaway five singing somewhere far... Far away. By the way, why did you need to come back here? You must have forgotten some very important item or gadget here. How's that? You've already guessed. Am I close? Well, you don't have to tell me. See you later and good luck. I don't really know. Uh, Paula just said we have to go here. Unless that's uh, supposed to be a hint. I gotta get a gadget of some sort. Well, I guess I gotta start looking. It's oh, there's actually animals in here. Apparently I can't talk to them, though. What do you have to say, dog? Ooh, 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 ooh. He hasn't got anything to say. I don't even know what animal that is in there. Uh, let's get the butterfly, maybe. That went somewhere here. Oh, no, no, it's up here. Uh, no, 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 no. There we go. Jeez. These butterflies really like to run away from me. And I don't like that at all. Okay, then. So, now that I'm back at three... Hmm. Let's go to the circus, maybe. I'm not saying that's what I have to do. What's in the circus tent now, anyways? It's just still people. Uh, problem? I don't know what's the problem with your kids. You're really glad you got to see real zombies? Maybe you want the zombies back. It'll be much more quiet. Right, there's nothing in the tent. Hmm. Apparently there's a gadget I forgot here. If I'm listening to the... Uh... Oh! Oh, yeah! I remember now. It's the freak... It's been a while. I gotta go back in here. It's the freaking alien ship that Jeff came here with. Can I repair it yet? I don't know if I even have the supplies for it. What would I need to repair it? Unless it's been repaired for me, mysterious... Okay, it has. We painted over all the damaged parts of the Skyrunner. Now I wonder how you start the, this thing up. And what about you? I wanted you to stay, but if you can't, so long. Thanks for every little old thing. Alright, then this is exactly what I need to use then. Ah, here's the problem, and it's not too tough to fix. Hang on for a second or two. One, two, three, four... That was four seconds, Jeff. There, that should do it. Now if we board the Skyrim, it will take us back to Winters. With Dr. Andonut's help, I can modify the machine to fly to Summers. If Dad, I mean Dr. Andonut's, is not available, I'll have to figure it out myself. Anyway, let's go back to the lab in Winters. That's it. Go, machine, go! Alright, cool. I forgot about this thing completely. It's been so long. Well, not really, but you know what I mean. When, you, when so much happens in the game, you tend to forget certain things. I completely forgot I used this thing to even get back here. Wrong way, Jeff. There you go. That's the way to go. Yeah, you better not circle Winters again when you get back there, like, for five minutes. Nothing worse than wasting my time. Even if I wasn't recording a Let's Play, there's no reason to waste my time with stupid little circling arounds. Alright, back here at the desert. I guess we'll be flying over Foresight again, too. And then... Maybe one more other place I haven't been to yet. Did we did we pass over Summers last time when uh, we flew on this thing? Well, it was only Jeff, so I, him. Here's Foresight. Hey guys, uh, don't mind the alien ship flying. So what's the next place to fly over? A place I haven't been to yet? Or is it winters automatically? Ah, it's winters right away. Cool. And he lands right away. Hey, monkeys! 
Do I still need a gum for the monkeys? There's the doctor. Thanks for taking care of my husband the other day. Oh yes, we finally tied the knot. Honey, don't just stand there with your mouth open. Say hello. So, you passed the, by a cave north of Stonehenge. Don't you ever wonder what's inside? Can't seem to stop thinking about it. Go see what's there. We're going to get out of here. We're still newlyweds, you know. Bye-bye. Um, okay. So, I guess that's another hint. I gotta go see what's in that cave. What about you? Oh, you surprised me. You're a nest, aren't you? Jeff went to what's his bed sometimes, but other than that, he's a good boy. Take care of yourself and Jeff. The boa monkey said there's a cave north of Stonehenge. I've known about it for a long time. The locals there call the locals call the area Rainy Circle, but I, I haven't been there. I wonder what's inside the cave. I uh uh huh understand. While you're checking that out that place out, I'll work on remodeling the Sky Runner. Oh yes, yes, my coworker Bigfoot dislikes violence. He's such a nice guy and he loves people. He often shares his beef jerky with me. Okay, well let's go get uh, recovered. Hooray! I need some more bottle rocket things though. Can I buy some around here? Ah, uh, too bad he doesn't have a cup of life, cup of noodles, not cup of life noodles, unfortunately. And Paula's a bit behind on her levels now. Actually, I should really save just in case. I remember this music. I actually like this music of Winters. I don't know, it's kind of odd. I guess I'll talk to Dad. Because it's no longer Jeff. Paula needs 16,322. I gotta talk to that... Whoop! Ah, crap! <laughs> I'll meet you back here then. Okay, for some reason I decided to end the game, even though I didn't want to. Why? I was a bit premature in pressing the left, or well, the right button, actually. Alright, here's Stonehenge. And I remember there was all these weird cave dudes around. They were way too strong for Jeff. There they are. Looks like there's also a bear. Oh, man. Do I really want to fight this thing? We finally got here. This is the fourth Your Sanctuary location, but it's mine now. Take it from me if you dare. The fourth one? I haven't even gotten... Whoa, some weird shroom-looking thing. So, I guess with Paula, I can use fire. And you... I really don't have anything, unfortunately, so I'm just gonna have to shoot. I assume fire should work good on a mushroom. Paula began to feel strange. Alright, then let's try... Let's freeze Omega, maybe. And you. Covered 88A. 217. As solidified. That's good. Hopefully he doesn't come back to life. Let's try... Uh, let's just use that one, I guess. Because it takes away quite a bit. Hopefully he's still frozen. Yes! He's not... Or is he able to move now? Whatever, I'll continue using freeze on him because it's good. He hasn't gotten that many attacks on me. He tried to disrupt my senses. Alright, I think I'm gonna use Omega again. Because it's really good. As long as I have the PP for it. And he's solidified, and he's able to move. Wow, this guy's got a lot of uh, HP. Oh well, I got Freeze I can continue using as long as I need. Oh no! He's so dead. Oh, recover. Life up on Jeff. Holy crap. I didn't mean to do that on Jeff at all. I mean, why do I have to feel funny now? Ah, dang. Now I'm poisoned. Great. Now I need to healing on G Ness. Please don't. Please use it on this guy. Gotta use healing on me now. And I'm running out of PP here. It takes 18 for this, so I gotta use this one. Did not work on Ness. Uh, offensive. How about Rockin'? And Paula, you did really got nothing you can really use now. Alright, I tamed him. 
<laughs> but I lost Jeff in the process. Four, two, one, one. Vitality went up by three. IQ went up by three. Luck went up by three. Maximum by 39. That's good. That rocks, apparently. PP went up by 14. Wow. Paul is 34. I have one. Paul's level is now 35. Went up by two. Went up by one. Da, da, da. One. Da, da, da. Uh, she needs to catch up a bit. Unfortunately, I lost Jeff. <laughs> Not that I wanted to. Alright, this is apparently the fourth sanctuary. So, like, am I in the right order, or am I completely missing something here? Because aren't there eight of these? Oh, cool, healed me. A steak. I got with a steak, but just for a second. That's the sounds to record the melody of the rainy circle. And it recovered me. That's good. It just saved me time. And everyone's recovered fully. That's cool. That's cool. All right. Now that I've done that, everything's afraid of me. I think that's good. I don't want to battle them right now. Should I try these cavemen and see if they'll level up? Paul. Well, the bear's coming after me. Let's try the bear. He wasn't so tough. And I went up behind him. And I can just bash this guy, apparently. He doesn't give me much, even. There's a lot of these guys, though. Holy crap. And the bears aren't afraid of me, apparently. Oh, well, let's go back here and see if he's got the thing to go to Summers now. Wasn't there a sanctuary behind the department store, though? How do I get to that one? That's a good question. Let's revitalize myself. Yay! Alright, did you finish up? Oh, Ness, Jeff, where it's his... Oh. Looks like you found something out. I finished remodeling Skyrunner. You can leave for summers whenever you wish. It shouldn't break this time. Well, maybe. That's nice, uh... That's nice, um... Um... Uh, whatever it's called. You know. He makes me feel confident in his own, uh, things. Alright, this time we're going to summers. I'm confused about the uh, sanctuaries because why am I on the... I've only got number one and number four now. Should I have gotten two and three by now or is this completely out of order? There was a place behind the uh, department store I never was able to access though. How do I get to that one? I noticed that there was a sewer thing connecting to it but I don't know how to use that to get to it. Anyways, right, let's go to summer and see what's up. Huh, boats. I don't think that's Summers. I'm probably just passing by. Hey look, a guy on the beach. Or maybe he's dead. Oh, oh. We're stopping. We're stopping. Don't crash. Don't crash. It's going to... Oh, you idiots! You did it again! And this time it broke even into worse pieces. I can't even make it out. Whatever. Eh, that mole's afraid. The guy next to me is really bugging me. He keeps following me around. Hey, stop bugging her. Wake up in the morning, fall in love. Eat lunch, fall in love. And at night, fall in love again. That's my dream life. Okay. Well, this is apparently Summers. Oh, hey, hey. What's going on here? There's a whole... I Okay, that connects on that side. I see. When do I meet Poo, anyways? You know, like... Because he's my next friend. There's a hotel. Hey, these guys, some of these guys were in a traffic jam, weren't they? Hey, hey! Stop putting your grimy fingerprints all over my car, you little punk. Eee, what a what a what an ass. Let's go into the shop and see what's up there. What are you selling? Oh, I welcome to my store. What do you need? I don't know. What do you have? Big league bat. Wow. Lucky coin. Gold braid. Platinum band. Diamond band. Wow, that's a lot of money I'm going to need. I am going to need a lot of money. Dad, okay. Okay, I've got a lot of money. I'm going to take out 20000 I think. Alright, I didn't end it like I did last time. That's good. Okay, I'm going to need some money for this. Also, I'm going to need to sell some stuff, potentially. Let's take out... 20000 Okay, now, what do I have in goods? Okay, okay, alright. Alright, I should be able to do this. This, 
we'll give to Ness. Ooh, nice. Yep. Yep. What else was there? Uh, a lucky coin, or a, a diamond. Holy crap, that's like 10,000 for each person. It must be very good. I might have to go with platinum for now. I could give it to Ness. Went up to 119. Well, at least I'm getting some money back. And let's go with the platinum band for Jeff. Because Paul has already got the platinum band. Alright, how much is it for that lucky coin? It's uh, 6,000 each. I'm going to need at least 12,000 more. Alright, cool. I'm going to need more money. And at least 12,000 more. Well, I guess that's why I'm building up all that money, because now everything's expensive. No, wait. I did not want to do that. Haha. <laughs> I meant... Ah, oh, jeez, I go too fast. Okay, I want 12... 12,000. There we go, that's what I wanted. Alright, now let's buy two more of those lucky coins. Because I couldn't afford those other things. Paula... Yes, always sell. And now, let's give... Uh, the lucky to Jeff and sell the other one and that's all I need I think what about you how annoying why are you all why are you wandering around summer is a posh resort made for adults uh, you don't want kids the big monster living to see between here and Scaraba I see a picture of it all right so that must be a hint some sort of monster living in between here and Scaraba not that I know where Scaraba is. Uh, what does that even say? What is this? I don't even know what that is. It's a club stole. This is not a stoic club. Oh, stoic. Please be on your way. Okay, that's weird. I like a bird. Can I talk to it? It's a minor bird. The guy next to me really is bugging me. He keeps following me around. Well, I know who that is. I've already talked to her. Museum. Before I go check out the Scaraba Muse Cultural Museum, it may, not be, it may be helpful to you. They may have higher glyph from the pyramid. Well, I don't know if I should be going to the pyramid right away, but there's a hint guy just sitting there. Let's look at my map again. Okay, there's a shop down there apparently. So now that I'm in Summers, what were we supposed to be doing here again? Apparently, it's supposed to be a shop around. Those eyes? Can I go check it out? No, I can't. That's probably not eyes. Kraken. I guess I'll have to go and stop the Kraken at some point. What's in this shop? What are you selling, man? Well, what do you got? Quite a defense, bottle of water. He doesn't really have anything I need. I could use some more rocket crap. Because I wasted it on that dude. Oh, these are houses I can go into. Any reason to go into them? I'm a grave robber. I was scared of the pyramid in Scaraba, so I didn't go in. But I tell people that I saw mummy-type monsters with my very own eyes. Fine. What, uh, do I really care about a thief getting scared? So, I gotta beat the Kraken then. Looks like Everdred. Do you know the Stoic Club in Summers? You need to call a secret number for a reservation if you want to get in there. What? Yeah, I'll give you the secret number. Don't worry though, it's a strange place. Hmm. Should I call for a reservation? Hello, Jeff? Oh, happy day. I finally got a hold of you. Oh, Jeff, it's me, Tony. I'm collecting players' names for a school project. You know, players just like you. That's right, you, the one holding the controller. Would you register your name, please? Don't spell your name wrong. Register my name? Uh, wow. Jeez. Let's call myself, um... Uh, da, do, uh, da. Where's my space here? Jerk... Face... Uh, my name's Jerk Face. Thanks, game player. Thank you very much. Is this correct? 
Yes, it is correct. Okay. I apologize for any troubles this may have caused you. Don't put my friend Jeff in any dangerous situations, okay? I worry about him. I really do. Well, talk to you later, Jeff. I hope that I can see you again when you are feeling up to it. From Tony. You got that? Well, I've been on the phone too long. Gotta go. Good luck. Take care. So long. This time, I'm really gonna hang up. Goodbye. Beep. Alright, let's talk to the cat then after that conversation. Meow. Has nothing to say at all. Would you like to ride a boat? Yes. I don't feel like saying a ship out. I worry about my wife. I'm not afraid of the Kraken. My wife's totally ignoring her magic cake business. These days she spends her time hanging out at a strange club. We no longer have any mutual interest to discuss. Is our relationship over? Sigh. Well, I guess I might have to go to the Stoic Club then. And see what they're being Stoic about. Of course, uh, time's running out for me soon, so... Let's see if I can just quickly make a reservation then, and then... Do they have a phone in the hospital? I don't remember. No, they don't. I need to find the hotel or something. Because apparently... Ah, oh, not more taxi cabs! I'll meet you after. Well, they sure have become weaker, I'll tell you that much. Okay, um, I need to find a phone to call the Stoic Club. Club Stoic. If the trees are either painted on or they're just very crappily placed in the map. Alright, let's see. Cost a dollar for these things. Alright, Stoic Club. Hello, this is the Stoic Club. Oh, Ness, sir. Would you like to make a reservation? Certainly. We're looking forward to having you there. Thank you. Click beep beep beep. Alright, I'm gonna go visit the Stoic Club quickly then, see what's going on, and then I guess I'll end it. Alright, Club Stoic or Stoic Club or whatever the hell you want to be called. Uh huh, is this the wife? I finally awakened the inner me, the true self. The patrons of this club are able to stare into their own soul hard, enough to burn a hole into their psyche. I'm now comfortable enough to stare at the real me, the true self, and burn the impression into my super ego. I want to be in this comfort zone at any time, all the time, or at no time. My id is telling me... Okay. I've seen this little girl before, I feel like. Actually, what the hell? She's just a Paula clone! Look at this! She's just like a Paula clone! Show? It's already started. Everyone stares at the stone on stage and philosophizes. Does that sound stupid? Can I talk to the stone? No problem, apparently. You know, I really want to eat some magic cake. It's a mysterious work of art. I can't get that cake off my mind. There's only one woman who can make cake, magic cake. She's hanging out in this club. Yeah, she's over there at the entrance. Anyway, the absolute irony of the study of self-identification is... Blah, blah, blah. I don't know what to do. Oh, I got a lot of info out of him. Hmm, I think it's a very complicated issue. Oh, sorry, I was sleeping. What? You guys can division the final collapse of capitalism? Incredible! I think I speak in reputation I'm not even gonna read that one. How do I um get you to make cake though? I came all the way just to eat my magic cake? Yeah, I see. Okay. Why don't you stop by a little cart out on the beach later? Alright. Well I guess I'll go get the magic cake then and then uh, Oh Ah! I was ambushed, I tell you. Though I did get a big bottle rocket out of it, which I'll give to Ness. Uh, I mean, uh, to Jeff as soon as possible, because Ness currently has it. Ah, oh, there it is, magic cake. Alright, let's go get some magic cake. I don't know who told you. You came from far off just to eat my magic cake? I thought making cakes would be the best career for me. Dig in. I used all leftover materials. This is a very special magic cake. Whoa! I'm tripping! Are we entering another illusion world? This had a dream. It was a very clear and very strange dream. What's his dream? What is this? Some sort of sky island now? Dalam in the far east. Oh! Poo! We're gonna be meeting Poo now! Oh, this is where he resides. In some sky island. Actually, it's probably a mountain. The place of Poo, the crown prince. 
course, if, I, I guess I'll just bring this up. It's unfortunate that he has the name Pooh, I guess. That's the first I'm going to go with that joke. Prince Pooh, the time has now come for you to undertake your final trial. Go to the place of emptiness and endure this final test. I am praying for your success in this final stage of your training. Ho oh ho! Alright, I'm now controlling Pooh. And... Whoa! There's brain food lunch inside. Why do all of them say whoa these days? Life noodles and... Whoa! Brainstone. What do I use the brainstone for? Hello, this is you. Is this at you, Ness? Why are you disguising your voice like that? Why are you pretending to be... Oh, who are you pretending to be? Oh, well, it's not a big deal. I suppose you need to have a sense of humor at a time like this. Deposit 676 into your account. Take it away with your shoes. Uh, uh. Anyway, what do you... Well... Um... Okay, so for some reason Pooh is able to call Ness's dad. Alright, that's it for me for now. Uh, next time we will control Pooh and see how he's going to meet Ness. And what happened after eating that freaking magic cake. Uh, everything just got all trippy for some reason. Anyways, see you next time.